My name is Rob Hymans. I'm the Koi doctor from Holland. And I want to show you how you can investigate a fish which might be ill or might have some problems with the skin. After we catch the fish, we tranquilize the fish already a little bit in the bowl. If we think it's not enough, we can dose the fish calm a little bit higher. We use a syringe for it. We suck it up and drop it into the water. We mix the water slightly and the fish will get a little bit more calm and cooperative. And that's important. If you want to handle a fish, they have to be cooperative so you can investigate them. So in the meantime, the fish is tranquilized and cooperative to do more examination or to take care of some ulcers or skin damages. What we do, we have a wound treatment box with hydrogen peroxide, with propolis, with desinfection spray and cotton tips to clean the wound. First of all, I take a cotton tip, I clean the damaged skin. You see the skin is reacting, heavily reacting, so that's a sign that skin already was infected. After I cleaned it, I put the propolis on. Let me stop it here. You put the propolis on top of the injury. It neutralizes the hydrogen peroxide and it covers the wound completely. So I put the fish under the water to show that the propolis will stick on the skin. And after you treated the wound, you put the fish back into fresh water or tranquilized water even if you want to take some more samples or take more care of the skin. And after that, the fish will recover and wake up again. So, the first thing we'll do is pick the fish out of the water We lift them up and we take a mucus sample directly behind the gills from the bottom side of the fish and even also, if it's possible, from the gills. And then you get the mucus layer from all three important parts. So when you're ready, you clean your hands with death factor spray to get rid of the mucus of your skin. Okay. After we collected the mucus sample from the skin and the gills of the fish, we collect it all together with a small slide on the big slide to the center of the big slide. We press on the small slide. The mucus layer is coming around and after we did this, we put it on the table of the microscope. First we start to look through the four times objective and after that we change to the ten times objective. You always look with small one to have an overall view to see all the big parasites and after you checked the completely area you move to the, to the next step. I will show it to you now.